Hey guys, so as I've been editing this video, I've somehow managed to drop one of my memory cards down a drain in my garden, which is very frustrating, and it has the whole start of this video on. I actually filmed a bit of a pack with me section. Just one of those things, isn't it? And I'm definitely gonna film one of those for the start of Sunday's video. So I'm very sorry that it's a bit of an abrupt start, but I hope you enjoyed the video anyway. Here we go! Woo! Right, guys, Woo! round two. Oh, oh wait, no, we do it We were here for round two and we are on the way to the airport. Oh, yeah. Like my camera woman. Oh yeah, that's what I'm doing. Yeah. That, is, <laughs> that is literally what I'm doing. <laughs> Right guys, we're on the plane. I told her I'm going to get to Yeah, customs the olives. I think it's still my book. Show what? I like the where the plane snaps. Yeah, yeah. You know what? You bet every single one she's like, go get a princess and buy stuff. She wrote something to say for him. Right, we've got the black blue gin. Right, good to watch you. Brian's got two little Prosecco. Keep taking chairs. Thank you. Smash it. And we're finally on the way. Ole, ole. Ole, ole, ole. Thank you. We've got the BA crew. We've got the BA crew. Look, look, look. Oh. This is the hen party room. We've been decorating all morning. Fabs and Eva are just putting up the last sign. We're so happy with how the tables come on. This is Megan's section, so she's got obviously Mask of Nile, <gasps> Mamma Mia themed itinerary, cocktail menu, glasses, little hat. Charlotte Tilbury very kindly sent some bits. So everyone's got a little setting spray eye thing, which is definitely needed this morning. Uh, beauty light wand, lip cheek, face mask, which is also needed this morning. <laughs> little necklaces for everybody, a bucket hat, a little clip, and everybody has got their own super cute little setting. You're doing a good job, guys. You, you, uh, you're smashing oh. it. You're smashing it. <gasps> No, maybe sack it off yeah. if it's not working. And then when we go outside, look at that view. Look at that view. And then we've got little pictures of all of us and Megan. Hey, look, that's us too. But this villa is just 10 out of 10. It's honestly gorgeous. And these are the gorgeous little pink pajamas that we're all wearing today, which is so comfy. And yeah, we're all matching. I think all of these were from Gigi and Olive. Uh, I know the brand is like Homebody. But yeah, most of this stuff was all from Gigi and Olive. <laughs> Like the day before You're like a stone on my pillow I don't make a sound when I shut the door Just looking at 
today because we have got lots of family here we've got me Elliot my mum my stepdad two of my stepsisters and their boyfriends a lot of family everyone is staying in our house we've got eight people but we are making it the most amazing spread of food so I really thought I wanted to show you guys because it looks like it's gonna be so good we actually wanted to do a barbecue and then we went to get the barbecue out and realized that we just don't know where it is so I'm assuming it's at Elliot's mum's I am a bit greasy I've actually just got really, really hot cooking. I'm a little bit shiny. I bought this fan actually when we had a wedding a few years ago for Elliot because he was in a suit. And I ended up spending the evening like fanning all the boys down and it's just the best thing ever. Amazon purchase, took this to Marbella with me. And just when your face is just feeling a bit hot, you can just, just fabulous. But yeah, I'm gonna take you downstairs and you can see what we've been cooking. So it's all going down in the kitchen. We've got Elliot with his uh, cycling sunglasses on, they stay on here, which have made, its, on hair, so. made its way into his wardrobe. Yeah. It's actually Mum's birthday. Happy B day! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> and my stepdad, say hi, James. Hello. Hello. <laughs> First time on the vlog. <laughs> <laughs> so I made her a lemon drizzle cake, which might end up being a little bit dodge, but that was my birthday contribution. I wanted to show you because. My friend Hannah gave us this crisp and dip bowl for a house warming. For house warming? House for house warming. warming. And this is the first time we've used it and it's just gorgeous. It was a house warming, it was my surprise birthday party. It was a house warming present as, yeah, as much was, as no, you would like to think like, so. Yeah, okay, yes. <laughs> yes, it was. Yeah, it was my <laughs> and then these are the things I've made. So I know you guys really wanted the recipe to this salad and I promise I'll put it in the description of this video because I did say I'd do it last time, I keep forgetting. But it's that same, Chickpea, sweet potato, kale salad with the most divine dressing. We've got a mango salsa, another one of my faves, which is just mango, tomato, red onion, coriander, lime juice, and then we've got the miso aubergine, which I actually also made in a vlog at some stage, but I can also add the recipe if you want that. And then we've got lots of meat, veggie sausages, ready to go, and then lots of gins are gonna be had, aren't they? Lots of gins. Lots of gins. <laughs> you can't stop looking at her smile, then you've been in love. That's how you know you've been in love. There's something about the way she laughs, and the way she always dances, when she thinks nobody sees. morning guys so it's actually Tuesday now so a couple of days later and um, first of all I'm so sorry for the completely all over the shop sporadic vlogging and um, I think I need to get in the routine of like getting clips every day if I'm away it's been such a crazy kind of week and a half I don't know if I even explained that when we went on Megan's Hendy we had some really dodgy flight cancellations delays basically everywhere from the UK to Europe at the moment seems to just be a complete disaster uh, our flight got cancelled on the way apologies if I have explained this because I can't really remember if I have or not our flight got cancelled on the way out we had to get a flight in the evening which meant we missed an entire day but then the end of the trip our flight got cancelled again coming back all on Wizz Air by the way who were just absolutely shocking and we ended up having our flight delayed next day. luckily apart from the fact that we had to fly from Seville which was like two and a half hours away luckily the villa very very kindly let us stay an extra night completely free and if they hadn't done that it would have been just 
oh god it, it wouldn't have been good let's put it that way we actually ended up having a whole extra day just chilling in the villa and it was lovely and we actually kind of really needed that especially because we missed the first day we just hadn't had enough time in the villa and we booked such a gorgeous villa but yeah a little rundown of everything obviously go and watch megan's vlog because she vlogged a lot more than me but we just had such a fun time it was like the perfect balance between being chilled and lots of going out and partying and everything we managed to get to the beach to some gorgeous restaurants hopefully i will have put a few pictures in as well to give you a little bit more of an idea of everything that went down then came back had like two days at home and then a load of my mum's side of the family came down and we went and watched my stepdad play hockey which is really fun it's just very nice wholesome weekend and then this week is just basically as chaotic ellie and i've got so many things on i'm going into london elliot's got like a really big sheet for his clothing brand mutual differences then we actually fly to greece for megan and Niall's wedding on sunday which is a bit early but ellie and i are going out two days early to have two days on corfu kind of like calm before the storm because i think uh paxos potentially isn't going to be like the most chilled holiday and um, just we're in a massive villa of people and i think it's going to be we're all going to be like very excitable i don't know we are there for long enough. we're there for basically seven days with in this villa of 10 people and to be honest maybe it will be a bit more chill because we've got more days there i feel like when it's like more compact everyone just goes crazy but yeah elliot and i have got two nights in corfu first we actually need to book a hotel because we still haven't done that yet and then we're off so yeah got a lot on this week a lot to get done but i'm really glad that i've managed to get this vlog out for you there will hopefully be another vlog on sunday i am really trying to stick to it wednesday and sunday it's just i am finding that if i'm away in the time that i would have been vlogging I just don't really feel like I've got anything to put into a vlog, if that makes sense. Also, I am going to be taking my camera with me to Corfu and Paxos. So hopefully we'll have a fun, you know, holiday vlog there as well. But yeah, thank you so much for watching, guys. I would love if you subscribed, if you do want to stick around. And I will see you in Sunday's video. Bye!